पाकिस्तान स्टडीज चैप्टर नंबर थर्ड लॉन्ग क्वेश्चंस एंड आंसर्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फर्स्ट इज राइट अ नोट ऑन बलोचिस्तान एंड पोटो हार प्लेटूज इन डिटेल द आंसर इज बलोचिस्तान प्लेटू बलोचिस्तान प्लेटू इज एक्सट्रीमली हॉट एंड ड्राई इन समर टेम्परेचर राइजेज अप टू फिफ्टी डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड नाइट्स आर कंपेरेटिवली कूलर दिन द डे Winter is moderately cold but it is for short period. Potohar Plateau The Potohar Plateau is bounded by River Jhelum in the east, River Indus in the west and in the south it is surrounded by the salt ranges. The plateau is raised up to an altitude of 300 to 600 meters. The plateau generally is poor agriculturally but very rich in minerals. Question number 2 is define environmental pollution identify environmental pollutants the answer is two factors play an important role in the formation of our environment the first one factor is abiotic factor for example natural properties of soil rocks sunshine water and air biotic factors humans animals and plants These factors pollute the environment which is known as environmental pollution. Pollutants are the substances that pollute our environment. Types of pollutants: air pollutants. That air which pollute our environment, it is due to smoke, busy highways and industrial waste. Water and subsoil pollutants in the form of poisonous water. growth of sub water plants and microorganisms in the form of bacteria land and soil pollutants throwing trash plastic bags empty tins and cans cutting down of forests absorption of poisonous substances in the soil through water and overgrazing etc question number 3 is What are the remedies of environmental pollution? Discuss in detail. The answer is remedies of environmental pollution. Creation of general awareness. It is our primary responsibility to raise awareness among the people and try to make them understand about the future destruction. Prevention of urbanization. Cities produce a large amount of pollution. The expansion of the cities must be restricted. population growth population growth is the main problem to prevent environmental pollution population growth has to be planned plantation trees and plants are the prime source of environmental purification the forests should be form at least 25% of the total area of a country conservation of resources Nature has given us a never ending treasure of resources so we should use them wisely. Question number 4 is what is natural vegetation? Write a note on Pakistan's natural vegetation and wildlife. The answer is natural vegetation. The plants that grow themselves are known as natural vegetation. Pakistan's northern region is full of forest. These forests have variety of plants and receives high level of rainfall. The plants grow there themselves due to the fertile soil. Dry and moderate regions are covered with wild grass and small bushes etc. Different types of mangrove trees are found in the coastal forests. Wildlife There is a large variety of birds and animals found in different areas of Pakistan. Marfor is the national animal of Pakistan. Deer, wild boar, bear and wolves are found in Pakistan. Snow leopard and Marco Polo sheep are the endangered species. Chakor is our national bird. Pigeon, dove, eagle, mena, parrot, peacock and sparrows are found in Pakistan. Question number 5 is write a note on the importance of forests also explain the causes of deforestation in Pakistan the answer is importance of forest 
Forests play an important role in the economy of a country. They prevent land erosion, produce timber and firewood. Wood is used to manufacture furniture. Wood pulp is a raw material for paper industry. They also provide water to the air. They prevent us from global warming and produce oxygen. Forests provide habitat to wild animals and place of breeding. Causes of deforestation Water supply is insufficient, majority of the population is illiterate and do not understand the importance of forest. Trees are cut in order to get wood and timber but new trees are not planted to replace the old ones. Some of the parts of Pakistan are dry and hilly due to which forestation is impossible.